For the season of cheer, there is nothing better than selecting fashion styles that show off the spirit of the holidays. And here with an iconic fabric that does just that is someone who is super iconic in my eyes. The wonderful Lawrence Zarian. I've used your oh, full you name. Oh, you did? No LZ. Well, because what we're doing today requires a full name. And you know that I love velvet because it always reminds me of my mom. I know. And I'll never forget the moment she wore this beautiful velvet dress. She looked beautiful, but she felt gorgeous. Right. And velvet is luxe. It's lush. Classy. And when anybody sees it, when everybody sees it, they go, oh, that looks expensive. And velvet has been reimagined. Dresses, pants, jackets, dusters, joggers, zip hoodies. Oh. Velvet comes in so many different styles and cuts. And I've put together three of my favorite velvet looks for all women of all shapes, ages, and sizes. And I have to say, you look fantastic in your velvet as well. Dressed to impress, I Debbie Matt All right, first up, we have the beautiful Linda in head to toe velvet. I love okay. it. Okay, this is absolute perfection. I put Linda in the royal velvet blazer with the royal velvet skinny pant. And what I love about that pant, it's the look of a pant, but the feel of a legging. And so great with so many people wanting to be comfortable and most of all stylish. And then I did the fuchsia tie neck satin blouse, the aqua black velvet suede pump. And this has sort of a vintage vibe with Studio 54 feels. It really It's does. just so chic, chic, it's sophisticated, and it's just, what's the word, Lux, rich. Lux, and I love the deep blue. And what you can do, once the holidays come and go, carry that jacket into the new year. Sure. With a turtleneck, a t-shirt, a pair of jeans, that jacket you can carry throughout the entire season. And the pants as well. Yeah, same thing. Just yeah. break them up. They're beautiful. You look gorgeous, Linda. Thank you so much. If I'm going to be honest, she looks luxe and lush. What is Obviously. That? What is that, velvet? Yes. That's a famous line from a movie. People who know know. Let me ask you something about velvet, though. How do you clean it? Because it can be kind of tricky. Every time you buy something, look at the manufacturer instructions. Okay. We say this again and again and again. Certain velvets need to be dry cleaned. Other velvets, like a crush velvet, can be machine washed. Oh, I didn't so know that. So do a little bit of the research, and as long as you take care of your velvet, your velvet will take care of you. Oh, love that line. All right, next up, the beautiful bridge. I own this dress, LZ. Well, I you know, I'm always dress. inspired by you. It's so beautiful. And this is such a beautiful feminine dress, like a princess that just glided in. So I put Bridget in this Vince Camuto emerald green velvet flutter sleeve wrap dress. It is figure flattering, and with every type of velvet, it's just comfortable. Yeah. You want to look like a like a movie star, but feel comfortable. The wrap dress, uh, the wrap cinches the waist, creating the perfect silhouette. And for the holidays, that emerald green, that jewel tone green, it's just really rich. And to finish off the look, I did a matte gold strappy sandal. So beautiful. And with the jewelry, you don't want to fight the dress. Right. You want to play off of the dress. And it goes so well with Bridget's beautiful hair as well, honestly. And the flutter look. sleeve is just a little longer, because a lot of women say, a lot of women say they don't want to show off their arm, but that flutter sleeve, creates a little movement, but also camouflage the arm just a little bit. And you know what else is lovely? The way this dress moves. Yes. I, I honestly, it's one of my favorites. It is one of my staples I go to every single season. You look beautiful, Bridget. You guys can meet up and flutter together. <laughs> <laughs> we'll flutter like two butterflies around a party. Thank and the you, way it That's looks beautiful. when she moves out, I know it. Now, you never iron velvet, right? Ever. OK. Because you can destroy the velvet. A, the iron is heavy on the velvet, so you will crush the velvet. Also, because of the heat of the iron, no matter what the temperature, you can also melt the fabrication. I know. So use a steamer. Turn the pant inside out, turn the dress inside out, steam from the inside out. Or if you don't have a steamer, the next time you take a shower, hang your velvet huh. pieces in the shower. Good idea. So the steam from the shower can steam out the velvet. Also, even if you turn the velvet inside out, still don't iron it. No, never, no, no. Still, no. It, it hashtag, will still do it. not iron your velvet. Do not, use ever. A steamer. Exactly right. All right, finally, last but not least, the beautiful Amber. Come on in, Amber. Okay, so I put Amber in a black jumpsuit. Every woman by now should have a black jumpsuit. And you can change the style of your jumpsuit just by layering on something. And instead of a crushed velvet, I did a burnt out velvet. So Look at how pretty. this beautiful, it's a black long sheer v-neck jumpsuit. And over it I put the paisley velvet trim kimono, burnt out velvet with side slits. It is It's beautiful. just so chic and expensive 
Oh, you could throw that on over anything. Anything. You know, you know me, I love a good duster coat. I love a good robe. I love anything like that that you can layer on. That to me is the uh, epitome of perfection. And so many people say kimono, a wrap, robe inspired, and all, all has that same sort of vibe. And truly, you could put that with jeans and a t-shirt and a heel, and that makes the whole outfit. Yep. It's gorgeous. You've done it again, Elsie. <gasps> Lawrence Zarian, excuse me. We have to be very formal. Changing lives, it. Debbie. One outfit at a time, <laughs> one outfit at a time. Thank you so much. For more information on all of these looks, you all can go to hallmarkchannel.com.